Hey there, fellow travelers. My name is Chris, and I'll be your guide for the day. I'm in Altlosberg in Bavaria, Germany. On this tour, I'm going to take you up to a fortress that was built in the Middle Ages, which is located atop a hill overlooking this beautiful village. Before we kick things off, please consider subscribing to my channel if you like to travel and enjoy learning about different destinations. I really appreciate it, and with that, we're going to start the tour. <laughs> Altnusberg is located in Bavaria not too far from the Czech border and about a two-hour drive from the state capital Munich, making it a great destination to add on your travels between Munich and Prague. This region of Bavaria is called Bayerischer Wald, which means Bavarian Forest. This small village of Altnusberg has about 300 inhabitants and the region is known for its farming and agriculture, making it a popular vacation destination for people looking to escape the city life to relax or go hiking on the trails through the forests. When you get here, you immediately realize the fresh air, a stark contrast to the air in densely populated areas. Besides farming, the surrounding areas are also known for glass blowing. It's pretty cool to watch how they still produce glass with their own hands rather than using machinery. Alright, now we are on our way up to the fortress. From the village, it's only about a 10 to 15 minute walk up the hill. You'll pass the small chapel and then walk through the forest before arriving on the grounds of the fortress. There is a small cafe with a few meal options, wine, and good German beer, of course. Every Wednesday and Saturday, they serve freshly smoked fish, which, while I visited, was char, a fish closely related to salmon and lake trout. Now, let's talk about the fortress itself. Not only is it the largest fortress in this region, but also the oldest. It was built between the years 1174 to 94 by subservient civil servants of the count in the area. In 1242, after the death of the last childless count, the count's widow married the Duke Ludwig dem Kelheimer and therefore ownership of the fortress went to the Dukes of Bavaria. Over the years, ownership of the fortress changed and ultimately ended up in the hands of Duke Albrecht IV, who ordered his troops to demolish the fortress in 1469. The following 500 years, the remains of the fortress would get covered by several feet of dirt. And in May 1983, excavation on the premises of the former fortress began under the leadership of the mayor of Altnusberg. Everyone was astonished by the discovered walls and buildings. The walls were about 2 feet to over 8 feet wide and up to 12 and a half feet high. The overall size of the excavated area was about 330 feet by 200 feet. The entire fortress was probably on an area three times that size. Usually towers of fortresses have four corners making them square shaped, but this one has five making it pentagonal, and it is believed that it was built this way due to the shape of the rock it was built on. And now I'm going to walk up the stairs up to the top of the fortress and once I get there I'll give you a moment to enjoy those stunning views from the tower. This concludes our tour of Altnusberg. Feel free to reach out to me if you have any questions. I hope you enjoyed the tour and if you did, please consider subscribing to my channel, hitting that like button, 
and sharing it with your friends and family. I really appreciate it. And with that, I say thank you and Dankeschön and Prost.